it really is the perfect situation for Terrell Pryor. Um, he was the mega recruit last year. You know, his recruitment even took a little longer than most guys. He didn't make his decision until about a month later, so there was a lot of drama around whether he was going to go to Ohio State or Michigan or Penn State. Um, so everybody knows who this kid is. He, you know, in many ways, he's like a basketball recruit. You know, we don't find as many of these in, in college football because there are so many kids and they're sort of anonymous. But in basketball, you get this all the time because the kids really stand out in high school and they get on magazine covers. So, and, and sometimes they jump straight to the NBA. But this is that kind of recruit. Everybody knows who Terrell Pryor is, and he's out of a small town from Pennsylvania in the, uh, called Jeanette. And... You know, for a lot of teams, he might have started coming right in this year. But you're right. For Ohio State, Todd Beckman is a good drop-back passing quarterback. He's a big guy. He'll probably have a, a career in the NFL in some way, shape, or form, maybe just holding the clipboard. But nonetheless, I mean, he's got that, that kind of talent. Um, he'll take most of the snaps. What, what they're probably going to try to do with Pryor, Jim Tressel and his staff, is work out a package of plays to take advantage of his mobility, uh, maybe even play him a little bit at another position. Not that they're going to turn him into a wide receiver, but maybe use him a little bit with Beckman. They've sort of kept that under the wraps, maybe play him out of the shotgun. You know, think about what Tim Tebow did his freshman year at Florida when they had Chris Leak at quarterback two years ago. They won a national championship using those guys in tandem. Tebow just sort of complimenting Leak with his running ability. You could, I have a feeling you might see a lot of that from Terrell Pryor this year. He is a, you know, he, he apparently is a very special talent, but they don't have to rely on him. They've also got Beanie Wells at running back, who's a tremendous player, and he'll be the focus of the offense. And uh, you know, Pryor will be just another weapon for Jim Trussell to use.